Hey, welcome to the One Verse Devotional. I'm so glad that you're here where we just dive into one verse every day, Monday through Friday, just for a few minutes. And through this, we get to just encourage us in our faith and our walk with God just a few minutes a day. And that's all it takes. And yet this will do so much to getting to know Jesus better. And so I'm glad that you joined us. Our one verse today is Psalm 119, 105, short verse, but so good. It says, your word is a lamp for my feet and a light on my path. Have you ever walked into a dark room and you can't find the light switch or maybe the the lights go out, the electricity goes off, there's a bad storm. And, and what do you do? You, you find a flashlight, right? Or, or if you don't have that, you get a candle or, you know, use the flashlight on your phone. That's probably what we do first, right? Flip the flashlight on our phone. And so that light shines in the darkness so we can see where to go. Without that light, we could stub our toe. We could trip over something. We could injure ourselves. Or if we're in a room that we don't know, if we're in someone else's home or, or if we're outside, you know, you have no idea the dangers that are around you. You have no idea maybe where the exit is or how to get out of that situation. Well, gosh, what a picture for life. Like life can seem so dark at times and the future is so unsure and, and we're not quite you know, sure of where to go or what to do or where to turn. And if we could just somehow flip on our iPhone and turn on the flashlight into the future and see where the path lies. If we could just flip on our our flashlight into the future and see where the dangers are and where to get out, where the safe exits are, if we could only do that. And yet we can. That this word it says, is a lamp for my feet and a light on my path. So dive into this word because this is the best thing we have to shine into the darkness, to figure out how to stay away from the danger, to find the safe path, to find the safe exits, to see where we can go for hope. That's what this book can mean in your life. So dive in today, spend time with God in prayer, And he will shine a light through the darkness. Have a great day.